sometimes in our front yard, the squirrels go and put their head inside the horse head feeder. So that they can get food. That's not food, that's just grass. But sometimes we've seen the fox inside the fox of the front yard. Very, very sneaky. And it comes quietly, quietly around. And quiet, no one can hear it. Sneaky, sneaky. Ah! Oh no! Horse head fell off. Oh no! That was one rabid squirrel. That was. Well, I guess it didn't want to be in. It, okay. Well, to be truthfully, um, the we've never actually had the fox come up towards the squirrel and actually bite it. We've just seen the fox and we've obviously seen the squirrels. Inside of our trusty horse head here. Which now I need to fix. And my mom, if you haven't seen her, she's over here. Let's see. Yep, I'm over here and I have the fox and now I gotta fix the poor horse head. Yep. Yeah, what if we put the fox in there? And the squirrel come after the fox? Yeah, that, that, no. That, Maybe that. there's grapes inside there. What do you think? I'm just gonna go now. Adios now. Adios, adios. Mommy, finish this now. Okay. My poor horse head. Wow. So what do you think? Do you think the fox might get our squirrel when he has his head in the horse head? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe and to like this video. And thanks for watching. This is great. He's even becoming a, something of a coronavirus crush. Yes, people online are falling in love with him because of coronavirus and how he's handled it. And I'm not going to lie, there's been people including me. My Tinder profile now lists me as a homosexual. And the thing that I've been enjoying about Cuomo is that we talk. Hi, my name is Bill and I'm a squirrel, also known as Bill the Squirrel. Uh, and today I'm going to be telling you what a day in the life of a squirrel is. So, I'm going to start by climbing this tree, because squirrels are supposedly really good at climbing trees. I don't know, this is my first time being one. I'm not going to go any higher because I don't have any reason to. There's no humans coming around or anything. So basically, this is how I spend most of my morning. Just sitting in a tree. And then, later in the morning, I get down, somehow, And I go to where the fork, horse head that has been filled, right here, and I eat from it. I'm not going to eat from it now, because so now it's empty. Sad. Squirrels don't do that in their day. And then through the rest of the day, I run around like a crazy person. So I'm gonna go back into the tree. I run from cars. I often try to cross the road. I heard it doesn't always go well for our kind. So 
be careful when crossing the road to all you fellow squirrels who are watching this. I'm back up here now. And existing. I exist for the rest of the day. For supper, I look for something I can eat. I don't always find something I can eat. But when I do, I eat it. Like a berry. Berries are good. Then, at nighttime, I usually hide in a hole in a tree. Keep in mind, there's not a lot of holes in trees this that often anymore. Then I sit in there and wait until morning. Then I go and sit in a tree and wait for the horse head to be filled again. So yeah, that's just, just the life of a squirrel, pretty much. Bye. Bye. to get into that bird feeder when I got you a nice horse head squirrel feeder? Seriously, where's the gratitude? I particularly bought that and bought some lovely squirrel feed so you would stay out of the bird feed. Maybe that fox should just come and eat you. <laughs>